Yeah. Oh, forget I am the sun goddess La Brasca. In fact, we are the most powerful spiritual platform. I welcome each and every one of us. When you see me in black, it means it is life. I welcome each and every one of us kevin kusia baby oh no 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 baby intro no dan kwa ma ye beja intro side na ma no no tro tro or see she is the spear of destiny call her queen hadasha she is empress makida call her the sun goddess well star number eight mother of all spirituality i believed you my queen oh se se or no intro no no yeah the juma so be so true be chain and we to see say an intro no is dedicated to Kelvin Kusi Abebi I welcome you my dear um Ruby Buedu good evening mommy grace and lovely family good evening my sister good evening support so good evening sweet family good evening John Diego I see Vivian my queen Vivian here yeah, high power platform no so tunchi hey 
Tunchi Hinchu. The biggest and the largest. I hope I put. I didn't mean partners will be doing it wrongly. I hope I did it well. Um, Philip Baby. Philip Baby J. I say good evening. The biggest, the largest, and the tallest. I be you know that that. Uh, we are the biggest. So, in fact, I didn't cry. You should be a kahun. Valencia. Hey, Valencia. Rather my bread. Brache, in fact, you know. Welcome, Revelation. What the, what the, uh, noise exclamation. Not to talk. Keep the fire burning, mommy. We are burning like the sea. You and you be a case. Admin, Majite, Gezi, or the sun goddess. You are looking sweet. Oh, thank you. Thank you, my dear. Rosemont, Esel, or we are the biggest. Rosemont, we are indeed the largest. Ben, or say, Mami, how are you doing? My name is Benjamin. Benjamin, I am doing well, my handsome, handsome, handsome follower. Uh, Cecilia, hey, Adinjira. Good evening, Mami Grace. Good evening, family. Good evening, my dear. Sweet Elam. Good evening, Mami. I believe to you, my goddess. I love you, Mommy. I love you too, my darling. Techi Bismarck. Or see, peace be with everyone. Family, Mom, I really missed you every second. Keep liking and keep sharing. Family, keep liking and keep sharing. Abi, you know that. that. Yes, spread it like wildfire. No? Florence Nightingale Kwachi. Hey, my dear, how are you? Family. I hope everyone is well. We are fine. Oh, Ankara Kobna Philip. Or say I'm watching from Dubai. Thank you so much, Peter Mensa. Or say good evening, Mommy Grace and our ancestors. Good evening. They believed you. They believed you. Anytime you mention ancestors, pair. Now you add nature day, and then you add we believed you, and then you send love, and then you send peace. I send love, and I send you peace, peace, peace. I Joseph. Idun, Mama, you are looking good. We are the biggest. We are the largest. Flexi, sexy, legsy. Hey, <laughs> watching from New Jersey. Good job, Mami Great. Thank you. You you make me. You are you empower me to do the greater job. Uh, Kwame Charles, or say hi, Mami Grace. I'm watching from UK. Thank you, Charles. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your time. Abdullah, you see, one of the main kind of comments, crown him the Obeka Dada, the goddess of our time. I humble myself before you. May you, may your blessing and peace be with us now and forevermore. So shall it be. Amen. And fear do fear. Say hello, mommy. PMA TV. Good evening, mommy Grace. I believe your highness looking sweet. Best regards. Love you, Lois. Love you, bunch. Um, the bright, the bright upon or say. Good evening, Mami Grace. I love watching you every day live from South Africa. Thank you so much for watching, my dear. Um, today is a great day. We are live. If I decide to mention, Minyanka will be calling your name, Susan. Welcome those who are coming. We are waiting for you. Those who are on the platform, I welcome you and I send you love. Don't forget to scream. We are the biggest. Now we've gotten one more. We are the most powerful. I... I welcome you. Let's look at um, Facebook people. I him for Ishak or say the biggest. Don't try else. Don't try else. Fire will burn you. Uh -huh. They should not try else. Eh. Or kweku. Ebise. Ebise. Or say good evening, family. Edna Entry. Or say good evening. You're, you are doing good work. Thank you so much, my dear. A queer. Mintabia or say good evening family. Alberta Ando or say the most important program in Ghana. We are the highest. In fact, you are the tallest. I welcome each and every one of us. In case today happens to be your first time, we are the largest, we are the highest, we are the biggest, we are the, the, the tallest, the toughest, the mightiest, the most powerful. In fact, the mother of all spiritual platform. I welcome you, my 
bad people, my loved ones. So in case today happens to be your first time, you are welcome to Consciousness Family. We are African Liberation, and we preach individual consciousness, and we are called the Pearls. The family itself is called the Consciousness Family. Today we have our brother here. Remember, anything you tell me to do, I do it. Hopa, give me impossible tax and see if I will not execute it. You give me the challenge and I execute it to prove my love to you. You said bring him life, bring him life. Today we have with us here Biakoyo Akube. Oh no, I know the be called life. No. So let's welcome him and then we see what happens today. Today's topic is the Passover and the unliving bread. That is actually the topic. I welcome you. Let's welcome our guest for today. I welcome you, my brother. Thank you, my sister. Thank you very much. Okay. So, so, so the mm -hmm. people ask for you, bring him back, bring him back, bring him back, and you are now here. So say hello to them, and in case you have anything to tell them first, before we get into the topic, please go ahead and do so. Yeah, first I'd like to praise my father, Nini, on mm -hmm. Pond, Chirneke, mm -hmm. Elder Mary, mm -hmm. for allowing me to be here the second time to pray, you know, to give thanks to, our, you know, to give thanks to him and also to bring our people back to him because it is important for us to return to our father. Our father loves us. It is us that don't love our father. We have forsaken our father. We need to return to our father because only through by returning to our father that we as black and brown people, specifically the Bantu people, because I speak about the Bantu people, okay? Everybody else, me, I don't care about them. Seriously, I don't. I only care about my people. So thank you very much for bringing me back and uh, let's hope that uh, you will enjoy the next uh, session. Yo, we welcome you. Thank you. We thank appreciate you. your presence. Abusia, so your guest and then the entire and then the acquire brofu sem. In this any manu ye di mo shana brofu fu el na ansana eche se acquire barre to se obi onu abanti ansa no one sam fall robber am fall kataso. In this aso na acquire to se kakong kwanya anti ni asa ni eche muno. I welcome you. <laughs> you are watching the biggest, so the biggest, and I am the queen, Nebraska. That's exactly. You're right. You're queen. Bam. Queen. Bam. <laughs> Everywhere. Everywhere do Laplace go, go, water go flow. Atija. Ija tum. Ajita. Mamele le kaye. Okay, so today our mm. topic is um, the Passover and unliving bread. That's what we are going to discuss. My brother can speak only English, so you know. So uh, if you have, you had any question there uh, for his last episode that you want to ask, him after teaching us today you keep your questions coming please let us center on the topic today or his topic the other day is also allowed so you would have you 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 will have him for the questioning today is your day i don't ask much questions it's for you the life is being given to the public whoever you want us to bring we bring the person for you welcome once again to your show, my show, and revelations to the world. Okay, so um, today we are discussing the Passover and unleavened bread. Uh, yes. Uh, when you say uh, the Passover and on the unleavened bread, what do you mean? It's the feast of our father. It's the feast given to the Bantu people, you know, when the exodus in the air, when the exodus from uh, Cairo, Egypt, coming back to the promised land where we are standing right now, where we're sitting right now. So uh, as they were coming out of there, our father said this month, being the spring month. The spring is the beginning of the year. He said this will be the first of the month in the first of the year. Okay, so today, or this month right now, actually just uh, on the 22nd of, uh, uh, of this month, we had strong rain. And that strong rain, we had a lot of thunder. That's the spring rain. That's the spring rain. We are no longer in the winter season. We were just past the winter season. So now we're in the uh, spring season, in which is the beginning of the year. And this is Southern Hemisphere. Southern Hemisphere, we are the first of the nation, Southern Hemisphere. Remember, it's all about being above. Uh, the, the children of uh, the children of our uh, uh, the, the children of our Kobe, the, the Abraham, is all about being above. We in the southern hemisphere, we have a higher elevation than the northern hemisphere, so we're above. The name Abraham means above in the book of Joshua. Above, he was made high above all the prince of Nimrod in Sudan in uh, uh, Babylon uh, during the time of Nimrod. So it's all about being above. Just like when you read uh, uh, John chapter 3, okay? It's uh, be born again. No, go back to concordance and read what it says. It says, unless you be born from above, you cannot see the kingdom of the Father. You have to come from above. And we are the children of above. 
because we are the children of we Abraham. We are the children so of Abraham. Children children from Abraham. Abraham. So do you think all blacks are, are, are Bantu people? No, no, no. Not all blacks are Bantu, and not all Gentiles are, are Gentiles, because uh, as I spoke to you last time uh, with my children, I have six children from a Gentile woman. Uh, two was born in Germany, four were born in the Philippines. And my, if I show you my sons right now, you will see his wife is, is Gentile. So if he has another child with that woman, it will look more like them. So we have been mixed, as the, as the Bible says. And when you read the book of Jeremiah, chapter 31, our father said he was going to mix us with the seed of man and the seed of beast. You know, uh, who is the seed of beast? The Gentiles, he's talking about. The Gentiles, because the seed of man is the sons of Noah, uh, Shem, and Japheth. These are the seeds of men, the seeds of our Adam. So, so right now, uh -huh. the Bantu people are part of Africans, uh, right? We, we are, it's not that we're African. African is a name. See, when you look at Africa, Afri there's only one part of Northern Africa, which was out there somewhere in Tunisia, used to be called Africa. Before, the whole place was called Africa. You can say Al uh, uh, El Kubulan. You know, Al which was Al Kabulan, you can say that. But to say Africa, that's just a name given to us by the Gentiles, spread and gone all the way down here. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the Bantu people, we inherit in sub Sahara, basically. We're from Senegal in the west, the Kenya in the east, to go all the way down to South Africa. This is the land belonging to the Bantu people. This is our land. It doesn't belong to anybody. But when we start scrambling, for our lives, then some of our enemies came and occupied the land, such as the sons of Esau, the Lot, uh, Ishmaelites, Medinites. We still have the Canaanites here uh, in the South South Africa there. You know, the, the Canaanites, you know, the Hittites, you know, they're still there. They haven't left yet. You know what I'm saying? So that's what happened and stuff. You know, so we start mingling among them. Okay? And then, like I said, then they start taking us everywhere into slavery. Okay? But So who are the Bantus? The Bantus, uh, well, Right now, if the, the Bantu, if you are, if you are from, uh, let's say from Ghana or from anywhere in, anywhere in Sub-Saharan, you know the history of your father, how they said how your father came from Egypt or came from Israel and so on. That Israel stuff is a lie. Okay, like I said before. The exodus of the children of Akobi, okay, come from, Sudan, uh, come from Egypt, Cairo, to Sudan, uh, Sukkot. From Sukkot, which is northern Sudan, and then and then they cross the Nile River. You, if you, if you don't believe me, all you gotta do is see that they cross the river. Just go to Book of Exodus, chapter seventeen, verse five. Do you mind sitting sitting with someone to discuss this? Oh, I don't mind sitting with anybody. Uh, is I, it I, not I uh, El Dalemuel that was saying oh, that it's not mind. every black that is a, a Bantu? Uh, no, 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 it's not. It, look again, like I says, we've been mixed of people, you know. So now it's very hard. So it's based on DNA nowadays. So you, like my son, I was just my son. My son, he looks, you know, he looks very pale. So if he has another children among these Gentile, you know, it's about DNA now. You see what I'm saying? It's about the DNA, and it's about the spirit of our father on young upon being upon you too also to wake you up, because the, the our, our father spirit doesn't lay upon everybody. Now it's a lie. When you read the book of Joel, it says his spirit is going. No, he's talking about the Bantu. Period. The Bantu, that's his children, that's his chosen people. You think our father forgot about who we are just like that? So the Bantus are the chosen people. We are the chosen people. So where are they? We are spread everywhere. We're here. I'm talking to a few of you guys right now. You know what I'm saying? We spread. We have lost our identity. Now we picked up this religion, Islam, Christianity, and all these other, you know, isms that the Gentile has brought upon us. Because why? They don't want us to call upon our Father. Because they know our Father is holy. Our Father is powerful. Just like in before, I have heard the cry of my people in Egypt, and I'm coming to save them. They know that. They know that our prosper, our uh, you know, our poverty is their prosperity. We are a blessing to the world. When the light, when people says, "Well, no man sees the Father unless they go to the Father." What is a blessing? A blessing is prosperity. A blessing is peace. Unless you go to the children of Akobi, you cannot see the Father. Period. Because you must humble us. You must honor us. We are the chosen of our Father. You must honor us, and they will honor us. They have no choice. They, they will, have no choice. They will honor us. They will come on their knee. They will lick the dust off my feet. Uh, Isaiah chapter 49 says that specifically. In our generation, oh, or in our generation, generation. I, I, I'm 63 years old. I'm going to see it. I have no intent of dying. Period. I have no you, intent of dying. You have no intent of, but will no you intent die? Of dying. Will you die in future? Uh, if I die, my father will bring me back like he's going to bring our fathers back. Like your spirit or uh, your No, he will bring the people jacket. back. No, he will bring all the righteous people back. That's what I'm same. asking with this jacket. No, no. He will bring everybody. Everybody that is righteous. They are not dead because, remember, our father is the father of the living. 
they just lay on their bed, they sleep, but they are still alive. Yes. So I'm asking uh -huh. whether uh, you are going to come back mm -hmm. with this your mechanism or you are going to come back in spirit. Oh, no, you're going to come back your whole body. This body? And this, uh, this body, yes. You this come body. back with it. But yeah, with this body, yes. With this body, you come back with this body. You're coming back, period. You're coming back. Adam is coming back. Uh, all the great, they're all coming back because they got to live their life because they, they are the children, they are the sons of the living Elohim. Oh, so do, those, father, those who are the not son those, of our father. So father, those who are not right. their children. Uh -huh. Those who are is everyone his children. Well, why are you worried about the other ones? I am worried because they, uh, they are no. also Don't fueled on that. this edge. What, so what, what did our in the book? What did our father in the book of uh, Exodus chapter 19? He says, "You are a kingdom of priests. You are a holy nation. I procure your people, and I have I have chosen you above everything." The earth is mine. So why am I worried about anybody else? Why? Do they worry about me as a black man? Have they worried about my father when he used to you know, knock my father down, when they were jumping on my brother, when I was walking inside, or when I was inside, the, inside of a bus, said, nigga, what you doing here? Go back to Africa. Why should I worry about you? I worry about my people, period. I don't care about no white man. I don't care about no gentile. I don't care about nobody but my people, period. So they are here. You don't care where they will go. About them. I, don't, I don't hate them. I don't hate them. I don't want them no harm. But it's my father that will bring harm to them. You understand? It is my father that brings harm to them. I don't care about none if of them. If your father decides to bring harm to them, will you plead on their behalf? I, no, I will never plead for the wicked. I'm not stupid. Why would I plead for the wicked? My father already called them wicked. My father said they are wicked. They are your enemy. Why would I plead for my enemy? My father said, if my enemy is hungry, feed him. If my enemy is thirsty, give him something to drink. But plead for them. Uh, uh, then, uh, then the fallen angel did the same thing when in the book of Enoch, when they ask Enoch, uh, uh, ask him to go pray for them. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Go. Oh, come on now. So if our father didn't accept the fallen angels, which is the offspring, why would our father accept me? I'm just a nobody compared to my father. Exactly. Know? Someone is yeah. asking a very important question here. Add them, Afado. Please kindly ask him. Is he saying that the Zulus? are not part of the Akubis. The Zulu are Bantu people. Uh, they are also Bantu, they are Bantu people. The Zulus are Bantu. Natal, Zul, Natal Zulu. You know, na, you know Natal? Zulu Natal? Mm -hmm. It's the sons of Natali. The Nguni people. They're the sons of Naftali. They were Naftali. Then they turned into Natal. First come the Boer. Then come the British. Then they changed their name again. Now they lost their name. But they decided, why do you think Ashak, Ishak, uh, Asaka, Isaka Zulu? Mm -hmm. That's the grandson of, uh, of our father. Shaka Zulu. Yes. Yes, of Yo, course. So, um, um, Adam Afado, you heard him. You are watching the biggest, the largest, the tallest. The greatest African spiritual platform, Penelope Buahin, is on the platform. He's saying, gain your consciousness, oh, gain your consciousness, oh, and liberate yourself. Why? Uh, yeah, not the why, not to at all. Uh, Florence Knight, take a question. Good. Uh, I think hmm, today be today. Today be today. Oh. Hey, Victoria Taylor is on the platform. Okay, so um, today your topic is this. The, the, please keep your questions coming. Let it center on the topic he treated the other time and also today. The Passover and the unliving bread. So today um, we are going to talk about this Passover and mm -hmm. the unliving bread. How are we celebrating this <clears throat> in this era? Right now we're not able to celebrate, we can memorize it. It's, it's basically, you know, you know, just like a memory thing. You just put it in your mind and making sure you do it and stuff. And try not to have, like, uh, uh, on the 10th, which is on Friday, which is the 10th of the month, you know, you would set the lamp aside. But we don't, we don't do that right now because our father is, you know, we are totally disoriented in a way, you know what I'm saying? But if you have, a, if you have the money, you have the lamp, you, you can do it yourself. It's okay. You see what I'm saying? But on the tent, you set the lamp and then you eat it and stuff. And that's the Passover. Because the Passover was for the children of Bantu, the children of Akobi, okay? Uh, on the tent. And on the 14th day, which is that evening, then you would, you know, uh, go ahead and, uh, and kill, kill the, 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 the animal and, uh, and eat the flesh, okay? Uh, throw the blood and the, and the fat away because that belongs to the father, always. Uh, when a father has a sacrifice, it's all about barbecuing for the people. Uh, the blood... And the fat is the only thing, the fat is what the father takes, the blood thrown on the ground. But everything else is just for us to consume. We consume all the flesh. <laughs> every piece that every feast that we have in the Bible, we consume the flesh. Period. As the Bantu people. 
and it's a lot. So on the 14th, on the uh, on the 14th, which is uh, uh, the 3rd of October, that will be that will be the fe- the, the 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 feast of uh, Passover. And then on the 15th, the following day, is the beginning of the unleavened bread, which starts at evening. And then from that day, uh, you eat you know, seven days, uh, no unleavened bread. And you know, it's good for the health too, by the way, because it removes a lot of the, the, the worms from the body. So it's good for you to be away from bread that has leaven for about seven days. It cleans the system. There's a reason behind it too. It cleans the system. It cleans your system. All the worms that come out of the body and stuff, you know, all the bad things that's in the bread comes out of the body. So it's good for the body also. Mm. Okay. And then uh, that's what it basically what it is. That's what's called the Feast of Unleavened Bread. It's for 21 days adding, uh, going all up to 21, 15 to the 21th of the month. But okay? we, we, we are not celebrating this year. Uh, we, yeah, we're not because we, we are we out of the calendar of our father. Okay. So, the, but the Israelites that you are saying, they are not us. Are celebrating it. Uh, you know this. They, they're not celebrating. They're even. They're not even celebrating the right month. Remember, we are the first of the month. This is the first of the month. They are celebrating it uh, on the uh, right now. They are celebrating the the, the seventh feast, the the month, the, the the seventh month of the calendar. You know what I'm saying? So they're on the seventh feast of the month. So, but no, this is. But remember, my sister, my brothers, this is Africa. This is where everything starts. This is the southern hemisphere. This is where everything starts first. So everything must be here first. We should never follow the Northern Hemisphere calendar. That's an abomination for us as a people. We need to get rid of anything to deal with the Gentile. Why, why should we have to worry about the Gentile? If we need wisdom, our Father will give it to us. If we need knowledge, our Father will give it to us. If we need understanding, our Father will give it to us. We don't need to follow anything pertaining to the Gentile. All we need to do is write them off. Tell them, hey, go your way and leave us alone. Okay, so okay. the name is what? Caesarian, hey, Austin. I say, Mommy Grace, please ask him if he, the unleavened bread is what the girls do during their festivals. That's possible, yes, that's possible. Because, see, again, like I said, the, the, the God people are part of our people. So they have that culture in them. So they are doing, we're doing a lot of things pertaining to our culture, yes. Mm-hmm. You know, the God, the account, because you know there's two different accounts in the Bible. You got a account that's spelled the C-H-A-N, and you have a account that's spelled exactly the way you spell it here in Ghana. One is belong from the sons of Esau, and one belongs to the sons of Akobi, which come from Judah, the tribe of Judah. You see what I'm saying? So there's two different, and one of them, uh, uh, you know, you, you understand what I'm saying? There's two different accounts. But I know this account here. You know, is the right account. I believe so strongly okay. that it's the right account. So, Richmond, yeah. Kofi Moonlight, Spencer, mm-hmm. or say, greetings, lovely Empress Makeda, beautiful sun goddess, Labraska, adorable spear of destiny, peaceful woman. I'm a woman of peace. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Universe believed you more. I'm glad I believed you too, my dear. Okay, so this is a question for you. Techi Mark, ma'am, please kindly ask him for me. The exact name of the father. Uh, the father's name is Nini, N-I-N-I, Nini. Just like here, I believe in Ghana, I've just heard that just recently, which I was very happy when I heard they said when the king, they call him Nini. So just remember, Nini. Nini. So remember, in, in um, being American, we say uh, N-I, N-I or N-E is still Nini to us. Mm-hmm. Ni, N-E-N-E, nene. it's still Nini to yeah, us. Yeah, we say Nini. Nene. But here you say Nini. But for me, as an American, we still say Nini. Mm-hmm. And I, N-I, and I is still Nini. So our father's name is really Nini. You can go to Concordance and find it in uh, H3068, uh, Concordance number. And there you click on there, and you will see where it says Hebrew. It says Hebrew there. And then you have the black letters over there. And uh, they change it because, remember, they write from right to left. They change it from Y-H-W-H or I-H-W-H, mm-hmm. which is yod he va Okay, because they're still in our father's no, name. Right. But when you read the right, when you read it from left to right, you will see Nini there. You will see Nini. Our father's name is Nini. So your father's name is Nini. You can say Sunini na Nini, no. which is Sunini I am. Sunini na Nini. Yeah, you know, mm-hmm. that's our father's name. Is oh, Nini. Okay, that is Techi Bismarck. I believe you you've gotten your answer. Valencia Brachi, mommy, please ask him what are spiritual benefits of the feast. Is it for our physical well-being only? Oh, okay. Watch. Uh, we have the Saturday. Let's look at the seven-day feast, the seven-day resting day. Uh, I will tell you, when I was in America, there was a time that I worked for, um, oh, man, I worked, my sister, people couldn't believe me. I, wor- I, I slept 
Oh, I didn't even slept, man. I slept only on on Friday night. Yeah, I slept on Friday night and Saturday night. But for five days, I didn't sleep. Uh, for uh, eight months. Mm -hmm. Done this for eight months. And they were wondering why. How, they said, uh, you know, because my name, you know, uh, birth name is Carlos. I said, Carlos, why is it you're not tired? I heard you don't sleep. I said, I need the money. I need to work. So I need to see, are you not tired? I said, yeah, I'm tired when I'm driving. I'm tired when I'm uh, on the bus, taking my vehicle. But when I'm here, I'm working. I said, oh, we don't have no problem with your work. Your work is good. He said, how do you do it? I said, I rest on my day, day seven. Day of seven, I rest. He said, what? I said, yeah, day seven. Day seven is very important. Day seven is it rejuvenate, it rejuvenate the body. Remember, it's a seven day of rest. There's a reason why you're supposed to rest on that day. Rest on that day and every body, your body will be perfect. I'm 63 years old, Mike. The body will be strong. If I need to walk from here to my, where I'm living at, I will walk. I don't care. I have walked from Usu many times, from Usu to Sango Beach. From Usu, from Usu, no? Uh, no, no, from Usu, from Circle to Sango Beach. Many times I have walked. Peace of what? Yes, I have walked. And if you want, we can walk it right now if you want. I will walk with you if you want, and you will see. And I don't need no water now. Hey, I don't care how hard it is. I will still walk it. I, will, I know you may not walk it, but I'll begin to have a walk it. So the Saturday, the, the, the seventh day is a day of rest to rejuvenate the body. It's mm -hmm. very important for you, anybody out there, the Bantu, to try not to work on the seventh day. Please do not work on the seventh day, which we call the Saturday. Don't work on that day. Let that day be a day of rest because then your body becomes stronger, stronger. Your sickness goes away. And if you have any sickness, all you got to do in reality is think about your father. Your father can do all things for you. Just ask your father to remove the sickness. You will do it because it's about positive thinking. It's about your mind. If you think about it, so shall be it. You know what I'm saying? That's how I remove my sickness if I have any sickness, you know? So uh, bottom line is this stuff. The feast is very important for especially, like I said, the seven days fast feast. And the rest of it is just making sure that we obey the words of our father because he has given these, these feasts for, for a specific reason. Okay? okay, because being belonging to him. But the seven day fast uh, feast is very, the seven day rest is very important. That is good for the body. Okay, so I think you've gotten mm. your answer. So this is from Azalu Felix. Mommy Grace, please ask him how can one know that his, hey, I think he wants to say he is part of the Bantum people, or what are the signs you see to know that you are one of them? That's a great question. That's a great question, yes. For me, uh, <clears throat> all it is, is is the spirit of our Father. Because remember to say, the spirit of our Father is the spirit of truth. So the truth will be in you. If you are searching for truth, righteousness, and peace, then you should know that you are the children of, uh, of Akobi. Because you're searching for it. Like you say, you're a woman of peace, a queen of peace. We are peaceful people. Mm. We never want harm to another person. Mm. We just want to live in peace. Mm. But it's the Gentile that has done the things that they have done. Because they are wicked, period. They are wicked. So it, for you to know if you are the children of your father, Akubi, and the creator, Nini, okay, is by how you act. Are you searching for your father? Are you seeking for your father? If you're seeking for your father, then you are a Bantu. You are a Bantu. You are a Bantu. You are watching the biggest and the largest. Uh, today will be today. Uh, um... I, I'm asking all the questions for you people. Keep the questions coming, but let it center around and, and the way. Joe, watching you live from Hamburg, Hamburg, friends of Mami Grace, we love you so much. I love you so, so, so much. I will see you guys next year, but I will still see you. But let me use this opportunity to tell people on this platform. Me platform, Nankasa. Any me comment session hold no more. A amount for business, amount for advertising or If you don't take care, they will use you for ngongo. Ebusia, I don't have any platform, any WhatsApp group anywhere. I am busy working. If I want to get through to you and you are even in in Japan, I want to find a Trust me, I will put you guys together. I will sit in plane and I will come back. I'll come to you. I'm, I'm going to Costa Rica, Mexico, all the people, Kakaka people, no? Well, I'm going to visit them. I will visit you wherever you are. I do not have any WhatsApp group. And if you think you would build WhatsApp group on my platform, it's your business. But I should not be your topic. We are watching the biggest. I am always Mami Grace Dediakon. One bullet. 
someone wrote a comment, I will see it and I will read it. Is that when the, wherever my grace go, spirituality go flow. You are watching the biggest. So I keep the questions. I'm, <clears throat> I'm reading the questions for you. This is a hey, Kelnatina. Please kindly ask him. Are all Ghanaians Bantu people? <clears throat> there are some that are not Bantus, you know that. But again, like I said, it's all about the spirit right now. Because if the spirit of our Father is in you, and you are searching for the truth, you are searching for your Father, you're trying to get away from this Christian stuff, this Muslim stuff, this scam that they have put upon us. Uh, my sister, it's a scam, okay? Bottom they line, will beat it's you. Scam. Uh, it's okay if they beat me, they can't beat my father. They can't be my father. They can try, but they can't be my father. That, all these religions, nothing but scam as far as I'm concerned. Mm. They're scamming our people. If you are searching for the truth, you're trying to come out of this scam system that you win, then you are your children of your father. You see what I'm saying? Because the only person that is looking for the truth, which is the father, is the spirit of our fathers in them. So you are a Bantu, you know? Again, that's... Oh, sister, that's I was searching for peace, sir. Yeah. So I was searching for peace, sir. Yeah. Then you are looking for God, then you are yeah. a Bantu. Just so you are back. You're not looking for God, my sis. You're looking, looking for your father. Looking for your father. Uh, and you get, get away with this worship, worship thing. Yeah, yeah this worshiping said? deity. Yeah, all these the other deity like God, Lord, Jesus, Allah, Yahweh, Yahweh. These are all Gentile names. Get rid of them. Drop them in the trash can. Let them be there. And Burn look for Nini. To. And look for your father, Nini. Onyankopon, Cheneke, Olodo, Mary, uh, Tata, Nazimbi. Look for your father coming from a Bantu name. Stop worshiping something given to you by your enemy. They are your enemy. How can they do anything for you that is good? They don't, they don't like you. They didn't like me when I was young. They didn't like my father. So I know for sure they don't like anybody of us. And I've been around them. I see how they treat us in an airport in Africa, in, uh, in different parts of the world that I have been as an American citizen. I see how they treat us. So they think I care for them. Give me a break. Mm -hmm. I love you more. Abdullah, you see, is my, my, my man. He will always he will always be on this platform. The goddess, please ask him in which language did he mention our father's name? Is that the only language that if you mention the father's name, he responds? Oh, well, he just gave a lot of names. Yes. Uh, he just get yeah. got us a letter. Any just, African any African name that comes from the Bantu, name your father. He's he there will for respond. you. He will oh. respond to you. You know. Because you are searching for him, he'll respond to you. But his real name in the Bible is Nini. It's Nini. So yeah. when you, um, um, this is, hey, Lavo Dossi. Lavo Dossi. Hey, if it's not correct, sorry. Is Hebrew the first language? That's no, Hebrew is a Johnny, Johnny come lately not a name. The Hebrew is a, throw it in the trash can. It don't belong to nobody. It, the, 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 <laughs> the Gentiles created that thing out of the Bantu language and the Aramaic language, African language. Hebrew is nothing. Throw it in the trash. Let the white man have it. Tell the Gentiles to take their, their, their Hebrew back. We don't need nothing from them. We don't need the language that they created from Ashkenazi and German together. We don't need it. It's not ours. Give it back to them. We have beautiful language. Have you, man, you know it's a shame, you know, our people, you know, how we have a beautiful language. When I see some Ghanaian pray, and I seen him pray, I said, wow, look at how he prays. It's so powerful. What is he? Then he put God on there. I said, are you crazy? Stop that crazy stuff, putting God on there, messing up that beautiful prayer. Don't do that. Don't do that. Look at your prayer. It's so beautiful. I don't speak your language. I don't hear your language now because I'm, you know, I'm an American. But your, the, the words, the, 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 the strength of it that comes out, it's beautiful. You feel the yeah, vibration. Yeah, you feel the vibration. But you want to put some. I said, don't do that, please. Don't do that. No. <laughs> this is Nana Yao Kwating, my woman of peace. I mean, you know that I, will, I no. love my peace, so I did my one corner. But the devils, I, I continue. My woman of peace, the beautiful sun goddess, the princess of the moon, and the voice of our ancestors, please kindly ask him. The Saturday Adventist Church are the true worshippers. No, they are not. Again, they're not. Any church, my sister, any church, if your father is not there alone, and you are not worshiping your father, you're not calling, praising your father, growing your, glorifying your father, your father is not there. If you don't believe me, all you got to go is go to the book of Jeremiah chapter 5. Our father says you assemble yourself by many in the harlot's church. Why? Because you commit an adultery against your father. Look, our father says he is this to us. He says he is our husband. We are his wife. He's our maker. He's our creator. 
He's our father. So when you as a woman, you only have one husband. So when we go away from our father, we're committing adultery. That's what says that in the Holy Scripture. That's why you're going and calling upon something other than your father. You cannot associate anyone, anybody, anything with your father. Everything must be in your father's name, Nini, or Nyankapon, Cheneke. It cannot be in anybody else's name because why? You are taking the glory of the father away from the father. Stop it. Stop it. Simple, period. Stop it. Stop it. You are watching the biggest and the largest. We're not lopi, you see, period. No WhatsApp group. Truthfully, I am not saying if someone is doing WhatsApp group, group is wrong. But me, I have work. Listen, I come to the studios when Elijah and his people are set. I work for them as a host. That is Jerome TV. It's, it's managed by Elijah and uh, Boss Kelly. And when I go to the consultation grounds, it's also managed by other people. And I have my own company, Jerome Groups of Companies. That's where I, uh, 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 GPAC Group of Companies is my main company. I, I go to work every day. So I have days that I go to the consultation grounds for the people who hold the office. That's Jerome TV. And I have days that I come to the studios to work in the studios for Elijah and his people. And I have days that I go to my own company, GPAC group of companies. I go and work there. That's where I make money to sponsor all these shows that you are watching. So what I do is that if I want to, people want to meet me, they put themselves together. I'll jump into plane if it is three weeks. We go and go through whatever they want us to go through. And then when I'm done, I come back. That's why I said I'm going to Costa Rica um, next month. I'm going to uh, Mexico, Costa Rica, uh, Santo Domingo, uh, Antigua. I'm going through that stretch for a whole month. And Germany also is in the line. Uh, America is also in the line. That's what I do. I don't have any WhatsApp group to, co to collect hundreds. I don't do that. So if anybody tells you she has a WhatsApp group for me, call me immediately in that group to hear from me. And if you want to create a WhatsApp group in the, uh, in the, on the page, I don't actually have a problem with you. I should not be a center of your discussion because I'm not your subject at all. I am doing this, getting information through to people out of love and clean hearts. I'm doing this for souls. It's not business. So if you have your issues and you want to do business, you don't have any work, it's fine. I don't have a problem. We all have purpose. We all have visions. We all have plans. But please take my name out of it and leave me out of your WhatsApp groups, Wahala. This platform has four legs and its own itself. It's not anybody that is sponsoring this platform. So please, the only thing that is backing this platform is love and loving of souls. That's what we are doing here. It's not business. You are watching the biggest, the largest, the greatest, the fattest, the tallest, the toughest, the mightiest. And remember, I am the woman of peace. So keep your questions coming. We are discussing the Passover and, the, and on living bread. And remember his, uh, his other um, episode. If you have anything you want to share with us, uh, kindly send it. I am the son goddess. Somebody is asking if he can name his daughter or child the son goddess. If you what you have what it takes to handle it, that's your wahala. Mm -hmm. uh, but it's a, it's a great and powerful thing. One should hear in swa or be she say je ashow. Okay, Penelope, my explaining what's up. No, I don't have any WhatsApp group. Me, I'm even surprised. How can I have a WhatsApp group and they discuss me? <laughs> How? And I'm not there. Th this is why Africa is not going anywhere. Big tadness, jealousy. What's in your own town? But yeah, you're to us. Maggie Asante. Oh, my. My one almost missed this because you won't miss it. We are always with you. This is Barbara MFA Glesu. Or see, indeed, the biggest and the largest spiritual platform. One bullet, sharp. It pierces the soul of the enemy. <laughs> oh, I'm proud of you guys. So I'm so proud of you guys. Eh? When I see the questions you people are asking, I know we are climbing there. We, 
will balance African continent. I'm telling you this with every confidence. Okay, so you are watching the biggest. People are asking questions. I'm looking for them to give it to you so you answer. Um, Victoria, tell us today. My Pope, I beg. I mean, <laughs> you are enjoying what? Another great person, T. Tommy TV, Queen City of Ejiso. Minister of Spirituality. <laughs> Mama Dedu Yakun, I greet you. I greet you, T. Tommy. I always see you. I am watching you. Collins, G. My family, good evening. Please, I'm looking for my sweet sister. There, sir. Who is that? Mention his name. Let, let me find him here for you. Wisdom Atakuma Fiaku, you are saying, I'm late. You are not late at all. You are here. Um, Richmond Kofi, Moonlight Spencer, say, I see, bro. Moody Moon Combo. Moon, for questions, Simbra. Bring your questions. Bring your questions. Bring your questions. Let it center around the topic. Uh, please, this question is for you. Adam mm -hmm. Afado, I say, please. Kindly ask him, does he recognize Yeshua and his teachings as coming from the Father? Because Yeshua demonstrated love for everyone, but according to him, we shouldn't care about the Gentiles. That's a beautiful question. That's, that's an add-on to the book. First and foremost, Mesendesi is his name. He came here to bring his people back, the Bantu people, back to the Father. Okay, he did not come here to administrate anything to any Gentiles, other than to show up his people, his brothers and his sisters, as it says in the book of Hebrew, I was not born like an angel, I was born from the seed of Abraham. I had to become like my I had to be born like my brothers and my sisters for a mother and a father. You see what I'm saying? So this guy named Yeshua, this is a made up name. Our, our brother's name is Mesendesi, a savior. His name is what? Mesendesi. Savior for me, see closest language. Messendisio, it's not Yoshua. No. And, he, yeah. and he said he came in his father's name, not in his own name. He said, If I came in my father's name, if another come in my name, like Jesus or Yeshua, you'll accept him. My brothers and my sister, it's time for you to accept your father. I'm coming to you in my father's name, which is your father. Stop all this. Uh, 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 worship and think that's not your father. Return to your father and you will see how Africa, the Bantu people, we, how we will rise. Because we will come together, now like it or not, the Bantu will come together. We will come together. You may not like it, but we will come together. Okay? And you know, you know, you know one of the greatest things, my sister, is women. If the church, if the church, the preachers would teach the right thing, oh, the women, oh man, they would be in front line. They would be in front line. You would be in front line. The women are something else now. Mm -hmm. They will be on front line. They will move the men. They will move the men. The women are very strong. Once they know the truth, oh, they will move the men. The men will follow them. Hmm. That's the why they keep the women in the church. Them. That's why they keep women in the church. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And they put the husband in, in prison. And the children become unwanted. Because they know if you can control the women, oh. Everything will go down. Yeah. For put, them. Let the women know the truth and see what happened. Ah. Uh, Everything will start moving. Will women in. ever know the truth with this? Uh, they their are jealousy and witchcraft, uh, 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 I, uh, uh, greediness. It's, it's just enviness. You know, I, I just don't know. That, you know, sometimes that happens because they don't know what's good for them and stuff. You know, because see, uh, witchcraft is, is an opposite. Whatever you do to someone, it's going to come back to you. Because we are blessed people. So no, no one can witchcraft you. I'm telling you as a brother, no one can witchcraft. Mm. They can poison you, they can do this, they can do that. But the witchcraft, they can't do that. They don't have the power to do it. Uh, even uh, 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 Balaam tried it, you know, uh, in, the, in the book of Number, chapter 22, 23, and 24, okay, when he wanted to curse the children of Akobi, the Bantu mm -hmm. people. And he says, no, you can't do it because they are blessed people. You can't curse something that's blessed. You can't curse something. He, uh, he, who we are blessed, are blessed people. No one yeah. cares. Yes. Yeah, we are blessed people. No one can curse us. You are watching the biggest. As long as nine go party, Mommy Grace. Please, what about the Zoom booking? It's life. Yeah. If I want to swan, I will be glad if you will be the first person to tear the rubber. The Zoom is ready. Florence, me booking when they are now. Now, if I want to Saturday live Zoom interview, let me know. If you have a guest you think you want us to go, the pearls, if you have any guests, if you yourself you want to be in the Zoom, you have acquired something and you want to share with us, please kindly text. 
your name, your number, and the time that is okay for you to the number 0244860092. You just only have to send me your picture for ad, ad work, your topic, a little voice note of your topic. If you have a guest, you want him to be on the platform whether live whether zoom whether pre-recording the platform is equally yours just send the name to 0244860092 just send the numbers there we will call them and get them on set for you if you yourself you want to be on the zoom florence it's open everything is here uh, it's only my time that disturbs me, but um, I love, out of love, I'll come and do it for you. So, Floris, if you think you want to be on the Zoom interview, it's possible for us to go through the Zoom interview with you. Why? So, just text me on 0244860092 and we are good to go. Ali Du, Mubarak, we are the biggest. We are indeed the largest. Abdul, you save. Uh, Obisan, a question. Hey, you people in conversation. You, mm -hmm, chat. you are watching the biggest and the largest. So tell us, um, one, uh, about five things you think Bantu people, like you said, the children of God. The children of our, the children of our father. The children of our father. Yes, Akobi. Yes. Akobi. No, uh, our father. Nene. Yes. Akobi is our gen, uh, ancestor. Uh, yes. And uh, Nene is the creator. Nene is the creator of okay. heaven and the earth. Father he's himself. the almighty one. Yes. The almighty himself. Yes. Kabi but he's is never he? God. He's okay. never God. So um, tell us five things we are supposed to do as children of God, as children of our father, of that we are not doing it. Oh, we are, number one thing, my sister, we are not worshiping our father. That is our demise. It, as they speak in the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28, I mm -hmm. believe verse 20, it says mm -hmm. specifically, you know, you're going to have all this vexation. You're going to have all this problem, all these issues and stuff, you know, because you have forsaken your father. You have forsaken me. Ooh, you've forsaken the father. So that's one of the reasons we have all this problem. Look, the Bible is specifically talking about the black and brown people. All you got to do is look at the problem, not only for as an individual, mm -hmm. but look at the problem as a nation, as black and brown throughout the whole world. Mm -hmm. And you can see that it, it's, it's about us. Mm -hmm. It's about us. It's not about anybody else and, and why are we going through is we're going through all this ordeal we're going through all this vexation all this uh, you know, uh, uh, punishment is because we forsaken the father we went away from the law mm. that's number one we went away from the law and we are cursed because of the law not cursed people we can curse us we are not cursed but we are cursed because of the law and that is the reason we are suffering that is the reason the gentiles and everybody is throttled upon down they walk on us they call us name they come here in ghana they come in any place in africa they they, they rise high we rose very low am i correct mm -hmm. they'll go high we go low that's uh, read read book of deuteronomy chapter 28 and leviticus chapter 26 you will see our demise mm -hmm. our demise is because of our fault because we have walked away from our father we no longer know our Father. So we need to return to the Father. As we return to the Father, the blessing that belongs to us mm. will start coming back. And the enemies, our enemies, our Father will humble them to come and bow down to mm -hmm. us because they must bow down. They don't like it. I remember one when I was in a, I was in a veteran building one time and I told that to the, a Gentile. He says, I'm not going to. I said, bro, you're going to bow down. Your knees will buckle down. You will come and bow down to my people, okay? So I don't care what you say. You will bow down to us. You, you will bow down. It's not a like this, like just like when we came into slavery. It's not our this. It, we it's not. We didn't want to go into slavery, but our father made us go into slavery. So you will mm -hmm. bow down to us. So forget about it. He said, ah. I said, trust me, you will bow down to my people. I know you, you will. Bow down. Yeah, you will bow down. You know, people, you say, oh, this platform, we don't joke here. Gain your consciousness so, so that you can decode the message well. Of course, that's it. Let's look at um, Facebook. Boo hey hey boo azana hey what of akabolan akan e ho no minim akan no ye twi nti minim how ha audacious audacious don or see keep on awakening us beautiful mommy grace uh, from audacious boahin thank you my dear i'm working hard uh, though it's not easy daniel nim ni Moak, hey, the goddess of Akabulan, please do not let these people be a problem for our ancestors. Do not let these people be a problem for our ancestors are already dealing with them. Akabulan will definitely balance whether they like it or not. Bam, that's the word. 
that is the word. Akoto Godfred, I see um, it's needed where he has a platform, Madam Masa. Mm -hmm. Yeah, cause ask your question based on 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 the topic we are we are um I mean discussing. Mm -hmm. Canal team, well done, Mommy Grace. We love you so much. Please ask him, what about those of us, nurses, who work compulsory on shift basis and on Saturday? What can we do to balance our spiritual life? Rest day. That's a great question. Yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. well, well, right now, because of the, the system we work on, we work on a satanic system. So all you can do in reality is your mind while you're working. Keep your mind with your father and worship your father with your thoughts. You know okay. what I'm saying? And that will give strength unto you and stuff. Because mm -hmm. your father knows that you're doing it because of the necessity that you're going through in the system that we're under. You know what I'm saying? But he knows that if your mind is correct, if your mind is uh, with him, he knows that if the time comes, you will not do it. You know what I'm saying? So basically, your mind should be with your father. Your mind should be worshiping your father. Even though you're working hard, then your body will get back. It will get the strength that it needs. Because it's very important for you to rest on that day. If you can rest it, if you can ask it, they can give it off. Fine. If not, then keep your body and your mind, your soul, your heart, everything about your father. Very important. And uh, your father will do your right. Seriously, he will do your right. I love my father more than anything upon this world. I love my father. There is love nothing your in heaven father. that I love my father. Florence Nightingale, mm -hmm. we are the biggest and the largest. I know the yaya matarekura. She said, yaya kesiya ma yata di inatiti. Benedicta Adomako. Mommy, watching you from Telford in the UK. Hey, I was the... Benedicta, are you part of those I visited? UK, my greetings to you, my goddess. Okay. My dear, greetings to you. Hope everything is well. Kwesi Digital, what are the symbolic... Please, this is for you. Uh -huh. What are the symbolic elements or hidden meanings in the Passover story as described in the Bible? Can we call it a way of life or the Jewish... Or the Jewish and... Oh, can't have a significant impact on us as Akabulans. Yeah, it, Jew, 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 being Jew, that's another word. That's another fake word, fake name that they create. The Jewish. Uh, the Jew is a fake name, us. It's from, it comes from the tribe of Judah. Hey, and yeah, you have fake Judah. things. It's fake, it's fake. It's a fake name. It's a fake name. It doesn't belong in the Bible. It doesn't belong to us. It belongs to the children of uh, uh, of the Levant. So let them have their Jewish stuff. Mm. You know what I'm saying? But the, the, the Passover... The Passover, it has a lot of significant value unto us because our father says specifically, you know, there will come a time that our children will ask, you know, why are we doing these things, you know? It was because the time that our father separated us, separated us from among our cousins. Because remember, the Egyptians are cousins. They come from the sons of Jephthah. All you got to do, if you want to know that Egypt is Jephthah, all you got to type in, a, go in a dictionary or go in a dictionary or somewhere, you type in the word Egypt, you, the translation is Jephthah. It's the sons of Jephthah that they hide. Was the sons of Japheth and sons of Sham are in Africa. And then the sons of Japheth are the ones who went all over the world. Uh, sons of Japheth did that too also, but the majority of the sons of Japheth is the one that went out and built all these permits and everything else. That's the sons of Japheth, the black and, you know, black men, black and brown men. You know what I'm saying? So uh, uh, the, the, the significance of the, of, the, of the Passover is pertained to us, you know, as a memorial for us. For us to re remember what our father has separated us, has taken care of us. You know what I'm saying? The love that he has for the children of Akobi, the Bantu people. You know, to show us the love, you know, it's, it's, it's that great. But again, like I says, we as the Bantu people, we have forgotten who we are. So we need to, we need to return. And the women can help because they are strong. I mean, most women nowadays, you know. That we need to re return, return by the yes, women. Yes, yes, yes. The women return. If the women return, I know most, for me, that's my belief. Hey, I, if another, the women return, the men will return. The men will. <laughs> There's a big question here. Or bring pom papa. Or say, hash. Hey. Which person did Yeshua save? Someone's question. Alexia Asamoa, Mommy Grace, I love you so much. We are the biggest. Eh? I send you love, thousand fold. <laughs> I send you love, send you love, send you love, send you love. <laughs> Collins, Jima, Mommy Grace, I say, Mama, please, can you ask him for me? Please, a question for you. Is this world coming to an end because I have heard more videos from different platforms saying, and also, is hell real? Oh, 
is your grave real? This would uh, the, we as black people in Africa we never considered hell. Hell was created in the, in our scripture by the Gentiles. So the gra your hell is grave, grave is hell, and the Bible teaches us they're synonymous. Hell is grave, grave is hell. Okay. Now as we as the Bantu people and stuff, you know, in reference to um, what was that? what was the question? Excuse me. He said. Uh, is the world coming to an end? Uh, no, never. Because we are the Bantu people. The world was created for us. The boundary of all the nations upon this world was created based on the children of Akobi. So this world is going to be recycled from the Gentile, from the wicked, from the offsprings of Satan, from the offsprings of the fallen angels. It's going to be recycled and given back to the Bantu. Uh, Je uh, uh, Daniel chapter 2 tells you that specifically. Mm -hmm. uh, chapter 2 and Daniel chapter 7 tell you specifically. This will be given back to the Bantu people, the righteous people, the peaceful people. Mm -hmm. It will be given back to us. Seriously. Yeah, it will never go to the end. Our father's just going to recycle it, you know, because he didn't create it in vain. So we are not going to hell. There's no, no hell. No, no, no. There's, uh, again, like I said, those who die, who are wicked, they will remain in their grave. And if you call that hell, then let it be hell. And you will get punished in your grave, period. Because you was a wicked. You did not worship your father. You did not call upon your father. So you remain in your grave. If you want to call it hell, let it be hell. You see? But those who are righteous, mm. you know, who serve their father, their mm -hmm. living father, they will rise back up. You know, Ezekiel chapter 37 tells you that also. Okay. You know? Kenneth, um, hey, be you fine. Hey, I hope I mentioned it well, can it? Good evening, a Jay Walker Christian. Love you, mommy. Mama, keep the fire burning. I am keeping it burning like, 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 Charlie, Udum Jay Juma for crap on Womiso. Live from South Africa, Apia Ajiman Bosompim. Thank you so much, my dear, for watching. Ken Ames, I'm in Gano and I'm trying, I'm trying to come and see you, my great. <laughs> Woman, mommy, great, please come and see me. All the pearls, when you come here, now come and see me and come and tell me what you have learned uh, from the page, okay? Come and see us and and you call first to let me know when you are coming. So when you come, we put you on, on cameras for you to tell us uh, what you have learned from the page. Uh, I will be glad seeing everyone. Some of them, when they come, they come on the page. The platform belongs to all of us. Atu Hato. Hmm, that's a move. Atu Hato. Ana Hato. Hey, goddess of peace, please, we really, really appreciate what you are doing for us. Mm -hmm. Please, I humbly ask that you allow us to ask questions once a while. Thank you. Oh, the life, Nadia, is for you people to ask questions. The life Anybody you ask me to put on live, I put the person on live for you to ask your questions. So I too, it's allowed, okay? Ask all the questions, just center it on the topic and also around the topic and also around his past um, 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 video, okay? Uh, please do that for me. Mami K, I say good evening, Mami, good evening, love. Um, let me see if we have... Um, uh, any uh, comments on the Facebook? Benjamin Kobla. I see we are listening. Thanks. Thanks. Ras Bello. Mommy Grace, I have sent you message on WhatsApp, but I never got a reply. The problem is that some people even say they spoke with me. Only uh, me oh, in The office, no. I only come there when they call me there is work. I come and work and go, just same as the studio. They call me to come and record. I come and host the show and, and I go away to my main company. So sometimes it's not me you are talking to, but I will make sure they respond. We have three great people answering, handling that phone. So when you people complain, we will add more phone numbers. So we put more people there for all of us, all of you to get through to me. But I have a days that I work for all these uh, organizations. I'm mostly in my main company, Deepak Group of Companies. Thank you very much. I think sir, my answer uh, will question Rasbello. So I will make sure they, mm -hmm. a Jay Walker Christian, mama, please. Ask him for me, please. There's a question for you. The spirit in the black, is the spirit in the black different from the spirit in the white? Oh, yes. We're different people. They don't have the same spirit as we have. Our spirit comes from our father, Nini. 
Who's the spirit come from? They come from Satan. They have their own spirit. Ah? Uh? Uh, yeah, it's not this spirit. No, it's not a spirit of our father. Our, spirit, our father does not dwell. His spirit does not uh, dwell in what he did we... not create. He, the spirit, the spirit of our father does not dwell what is not his. Because why? He allowed its fallen angels to be within themselves. Because they, he said, you was once above... You was once above, and you came down and messed with these things. You will remain. I will never let you. I will never uh, 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 give you repentance. Okay, you see what I'm saying? No, they don't have. We don't have okay, the same okay, spirit okay. at all. At all. At all. Okay, at okay, all. Okay, at, okay, at all. When you will answer, oh, hmm. you see the spirit of. <laughs> we as black and brown people, we have a spirit, and we 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 tend to see to do the things all that is right. You know, peaceful. We are peaceful people. When they come around us, we want to give them the rolling carpet. We want to give them the red carpet. We want to give them everything. We want to give them everything. But when we come to them, they treat us like diddly. They don't have the same spirit. Anyone that does things like, you know, their spirit is not correct. Hmm? We don't have the same spirit. We don't have the same father. How can we have the same spirit? And who is their father? Uh, Satan and the offsprings. That's who their father is. The Bible tells you that the offsprings of Satan, period. End of story. They're not my, they're not the my white, brothers. The white, which ones? Uh, the all Gentiles, of all of the Gentiles. Anyone with E6 uh, DNA series, they're all Gentiles, seed of the Satan, period. If the E6 DNA, hey, you are the children of Satan. <laughs> like it or not, that's who you are, finished. <laughs> Be happy. And if you got a problem, go see my father. You are watching the big mm. guys, so <laughs> I'm trying to remember uh, something, but me raise it. When a guy said, I see a mouthful called Shobi, now, or no cotton, I don't know who say we are so full at the whole. No, say, hey, I'm not better now. Oh, you soon saw where the be there or by a bull. Hey, they are gentiles. Are they gent? They've been mutated for so much, you know. They've been and mutated. They are offspring of what? Ah, the offspring of the fallen angels. Stick with you are. That's the end of story. You're not my father. You're not my brother now. You and I don't have the same DNA. I have a six series, nine series hey, DNA. You where? have a six series DNA. How are you, my brother? Ah, give me that. Stay with your father. Stick with my okay, father. Okay, so uh, mm -hmm. this is um, Fofie Kofi TB. Mm -hmm. Please, Mama, ask him for me why we need the Bible. Why do we need the Bible? Because it's the words of our father. And it's good for us. And if you really truly look at the words of our father and look at our condition as black and brown people, how we are hated by everyone. Let's look what it says in the book of Matthew chapter 24. Let me use that. It says you will be hated by all nations. You will be called by a byword. Do you think it's talking about Christians? It's talking about the black and brown people. We are the ones that's hated by everywhere we go. Ah, but let me ask this. Ah. These people, the the the, 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 the Gentiles. The, the Gentiles and uh -huh. the, the the generation of the, the, the generation of Satan. Uh -huh. These people put the Bible together for you. Uh, no, no. They, they, the, our father allowed them to do that. But their intent was to their intent was to confuse us. But our father is merciful. Our father is righteous. So he allowed them to do that. So even the words that they have done, the changes they have done, the changes is their own demise. Because look, if the Bible look, look, we all know the Bible is talking about black and brown people. We all know that. If you don't know that, then you're sleeping. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you 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 still need to wake up. Because the Bible is talking about black and brown people. Period. It's talking about what we were going through. What's our past life? Our present situation that we are going through, which is uh, we are being abused by all these Gentiles. They come into our land, they take whatever that belongs to them. Our leaders are nothing but coconuts. Huh? You know, uh, they are coconuts. Our you know leaders that. are coconuts. Uh, they are nothing but coconuts, uh, except maybe the ones that's got rising right now. Because if you are doing something contrary, contrary against your people to support the welfare of the Gentile, then you are a coconut because your people should be number one. Coconut, the dry one or the soft one? Uh, no, the, the either one. Because it's still <laughs> wet inside. <laughs> either one. They still were dark inside. Because your your mission as a leader, as a leader, I look at you as a father. Because a father's responsibility mm. is to take care of his children. Am I correct? So how you as a father, as a leader, you are not taking care of your people. What is, I think it's the book of Timothy where it says, first you should take care of your household and your people. I, I believe that's first Timothy. I'm correct. I don't know for sure. I remember for sure. Uh, take care of your people and, uh, and your people and, and your house. So what, what are they doing for us? What, what, really, what are they doing for us? They, they take, and what does it say in the book of Proverbs? It says, it says the, the, the wealth of the world belongs to the people and the government is the steward to the land. But the people, the land, the, the wealth belongs to the people. But in Africa and everywhere else where black people is at, uh, it belongs to the leaders. Well, well who, who gave you the right to take what belongs to our people? 
Should we not, is this, is this not our prosperity? Is it what it gives us peace? Is by us having the wealth? Let's look at the rest of these uh, Middle East, uh, these Gentiles, how they set up their own king, their, their, their thing. That's why in the book of Jeremiah, it says that our people are very wicked and we have become more wicked than the wicked because we are taken from our people and given to the Gentiles. Stop it. Don't let the Gentile have nothing from Africa. Everything they want, tell them you want gold for it. Don't tell them that you want to pay Satan money, dollar, uh, uh, currency. It's all Satan's money. Hey! Uh, my sister, our father in the Bible says money is gold and silver and commodity. Period. Anything that's not money, if it's paper money, digital money, that's Satan's system we're under. We're under Satan's system. Hey, Boussia. Oh, come on, huh? We need to wake up as a people, you know, and start coming together and, and, and really, you know, and, uh, you know, get the system right. Get back to our father. Okay, we... that's, that's a, a very important question here. Mm -hmm. Very important question here. A jaywalker Christian. Please, mama, I know black people are the people who gave birth to the albino. So how can they have different spirits? Uh, look, very simple. Let's look at book. Let's look at uh, uh, the book of Enoch. The book of Enoch, mm -hmm. or is it the book? Of, yeah, the book of Enoch. When uh, uh, when Noah was born, Noah was born albino. For your information, I can read it for you if you want. Noah was born albino. Yeah, he was born like that. And when he was born, Lamech ran away. He ran away. Oh, he's like, see, he's fly away. <laughs> 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 he went to see his aunt, his grandfather. He went to see his father, the Methuselah. He says, "I have a child who is not." Of man, it says human over there, but it's no such thing as human. You know, it's, it's not men. He's born like the fallen angel. He's born like the children of the fallen angel of the angel. Yes, the offsprings of the angel. You can read that in the book of uh, Enoch if you want. It's in the book of Enoch. You see, so Noah was born out of being, but his children, his children came out to be black and brown. You see what I'm saying? Because why? We as black and brown people, we can create albino race. Right now, my son, I, I will show you. Uh, my son, my younger son, he's he's becoming leopard. Uh, I will show you my younger son. You can see that yourself. You can see how he's changed. His face is changing. See, this is my son. See how he's changing? He's changing left. He's turning pale. He's turning pale. That's who we are. That's Miriam. When Mary was turned pale, in the book of Number, when she was changed, when she complained about Moses being married to Ethiopia, actually it was a Midianite. But anyway, it says Ethiopia. Still, that's around the same area. So that's my son. How he's changing. I have nothing against, I, I can't change, it's the father that's changing him for whatever reason he's changing for. So I know it's my father that will change him back. You see, my young, one of my younger sons. Mm. You, know? you are watching the biggest so different concepts of faith and beliefs. Hey, revelations, if you hate it, Charlie, mm. you hate like you hate your own soul. Uh, Barbara, MFA, Gesu, I see you see the food is, is tracking you Love, sir. Oh, Odin and Combo. Deliverance, dear. Here be Wagana or Brimpong. Here be Wagana, Papa Deliverance. Shalla. Kofi, Brobe, or say to two. Mommy, consider Belgium someday. Watch me. What do you say? If you don't know, you know. If you know it too, you know. Um, Revelation. I fit leg be. Hey, you ready? Bombay, mean to me, mean, mean to me, what do you know? To me, really, I didn't know what Hey, please, Mama, ask him for me why we need the Bible. So I've asked him. Then, Ado, Mommy, Grace, I'm here because of the vibration and energy in your laughter. You are a great woman and a blessing to Ghana. I'm a free soul. <laughs> I'm a free soul, oh, and I love love. I love love, and I hate hate. I love love. So my vibrations, dear Kronji, thank you so much, my dear. Andrew, I see you do. Mommy Grace, please ask him. Please, a question for you. It's a word of our father, Nini. That's okay. why we need it. A question the for you. Mm -hmm. Andrew, Andrew, I see you do. Mommy Grace, please ask him for me about pig meat. Is it good for us to eat? It's an abomination. <laughs> it's an abomination. <laughs> they pig, want to know. Pig meat, catfish, tuna, lobster, shrimp, 
anything that crawls upon the ground, uh, especially in the ocean. All the snake, all the cat, dog. You, why would you want to eat these things? Our father didn't make it for us. He said the other nation can eat it. But you, Bantu, you are holy to me. You have been separated. The word holy means separate. I have separated you from among the people of this world. So you are not to be eating all this junk because I was here. it's bad for you. Mention them again. Uh, catfish, tuna, lobster, shrimp, uh, dog. Cat, uh, snake, all these things. You're not, sh- you're not to eat these things. <laughs> snake it. 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 just killing yourself. You just killing yourself. Just killing yourself. That's all you're doing. You're killing yourself. Our father don't want us. No, to eat. he don't want us to eat that now stuff. Now, why did he create them then? Oh, uh, he not to be chopped down by human being. He gave he not by, by by man. He gave us the things that's what's edible in the book of Leviticus chapter uh, uh, excuse me, <laughs> uh, chapter eleven, I believe. Uh, Leviticus chapter eleven, and also in the book of Numbers chapter fourteen. So he tell us what's holy for us to eat. So why shouldn't we obey what is holy? Uh, the, the, like the lady asked, what good is the Bible? The Bible is is the words of our father who has okay. been plagiarized by the Gentile but still brought to us by our father. So we should listen to what the word has. But the main thing is, don't be picked by, by any, uh, uh, if it's King James, fine. If it's not King James, stay away from it. Let it be King James Bible. Don't touch any other Bible because they keep taking the truth out of it mm. because they know we are waking up to the truth. As we wake up, we will speak. They know that already. So they got to hide the truth some more. You know? <laughs> so stick what to was King James stay away, Ukraine, mm. be pe Hey, moon stay away in some way. Uh, uh, when you are a father, snap, uh, snap cell. Mommy, good evening. Ingredient mm. for birthday admission. Which is that? Uh, I don't know. Feli baby J. Or see, please, ma. I sent you a WhatsApp, but still not receiving reply. And what are the pearls? What are the pearls? It means I have to be a member shift for monthly subscription oh no 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 at the moment you subscribe you are automatically a pearl because the page itself purges itself it separates it separates the wheat from the chaff and to my page you know so now we're a chaff are you fall off uh, yes pray on to send and you know at the moment you subscribe just keep learning and you know work on yourself don't depend on me just take the informations and work on yourself we groom or we grow together so you are a pair okay that's why you are here and i'm reading your comment we love love and hate hate benedicta adomaku i say please mommy as for me if god can please this question is for you uh-huh mm, benedicta adomaku please mommy ask for me if mm. god can forgive us if yes what can we do for him to forgive us Forgive. Thank you. Uh, our Father forgives us for any sin. He tells you that when you have returned to Him. When you return to Him, if you kill a thousand people, He will forgive you of your sin. He talks about in the book of Ezekiel chapter 18, you know, and you also talk about that in the book of Ezekiel chapter 36, you see. So when you truly, when your heart and your mind return to your Father, and you repent for your actions and the actions of your forefather, our father will forgive you. You don't need to be washed by any blood. You don't need to be none of that. It's just the word. It is the word that makes you clean. You see what I'm saying? Because you're returning to your father. Your father loves you. He's waiting for you to return to him. So return mm. to your father, and he will forgive you of all your sins and stuff, you know. And, and no, don't commit him again. That's the main thing. Don't make the same mistake again. Because if you return to other idols, if you return, not, excuse me, if you return to idols, other deities, then your father will make you have an illusion that you will never remember who you are. Then you will still be in that illusion. Don't do that. Once you have returned to your father, trust me, you become more humble. You become more strong. You are spiritual, more contact with your people because you're going to start understanding your brothers and your sisters, their attitude, their ways. You can say, okay, I understand my brother now. You see what I'm saying? And you start forgiving them for things that they may do for you that require to be forgiven. You see what I'm saying? You don't be holding grudges against them. Mm. You know, you don't. Because why should you? Because you know he's your brother. Why are you holding grudge against That's your it. brother? Finish. Let it go. It happened. It happened. Finish. Wash with it. You move Throw on. Away. Move on, you know? I say what I say. I say, 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 I
we move on na wo ko wanim eh they will respond tomorrow i will personally make sure they respond every uh, 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 text message Benedict Adomako, please, mommy, ask God. Okay, maybe say no. I'm out of that. I work and I work here. Jennifer. Hey. Good evening, Abusia 4. Tonight is another great night. We are going to learn a lot, of course. Hey, uh, Kuyabima, Feli Baby, please, if you are sus a subscriber, you are a pal. Uh, well done. Techi Bismarck, please, this is a question for you. Mm. Should I shoot? I shoot, my sister. Okay. Please. I said, ma'am, please, ask him how do we worship our father? That's a great question. Very simple. You get on your knees, and you, you spread your hand, and you pray to your father. And you open your eyes. Don't, don't close your eyes. This is not a Christian thing. Open your eyes. You're talking to your father. If you're talking to your father, your eyes must be open, because if I'm your father, I'm sitting here, you're sitting there. Are you going to talk to me? Are you going to close your eyes? No. You want your eyes to be open. So you can. Sp you are speaking to your father. It's a one-on-one -on -one dialect. It's a one-on-one -on -one conversation you have with your father. You know, Family conversation. It's a family conversation with your father. So you pray to him. You talk to him. So why do they close their eyes? It's because they don't want you to understand that they were stealing everything from you. They don't want you to close your eyes. Hey, wait. <laughs> hey, <Bushi. laughs> Yeah, <laughs> 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 no, that's how you deal with your father, and always point in the right direction. Point to, if you in the if you in the north, point towards South Africa. Why? Because that is the place where our father's home is at. Mm. So it's very important for you to know that. See, people say, "Well, uh, you can pray anywhere." Yes, correct, you can pray anywhere, but you have to pray in the direction it asks you to pray. There's a direction in the direction where our father's temple is what it was that's where you must pray south africa always point to that right which is south here it's south southeast you know you pray towards that direction to your father hmm, you know you down there in kalahari desert in botswana you know that's where the temple is at that's where the temple used to be at oh mm. Vitaya, me do be what um this question is important too uh, please can we offer water libation to nini or how do we pray to the father? Oh, our father loves libation. Oh, oh he loves libation. It's all over the book. It's all over our book. It's our, it's our culture. Wait, what? If it, off, drink offering. You always drink offering. Our father likes when you drink offering stuff to him. You know, libation. There's nothing wrong with that. It's hey, drink offering. It's in the Bible. Yeah. It's, it's he it's likes Bible. libation. Uh, yes, our father. Uh, look, our father, I believe it's in the book of Number. It says if you're in a northern place, because, you know, we have to go see him every three years. So if you're in the north and you have a lot of stuff you're going to bring because he's blessed you, he has increased your blessing. So and then you can tell, sell that stuff. And then when you get down to south, when you get south, buy whatever you want, even strong drink now, nah, even strong drink. Come and enjoy with your father. So ah, Yes, your father loves, he loves us people. <laughs> he wants us to have a good oh, time. Go, go, go. Yeah, he wants us to have a good time among ourselves. That's what our father's about. He loves Abusia, us to have a good time. Miss yes. Mark, yes, he so loves libation. Yes, it's, it's not um, wrong with doing libation to your father. Uh, no boy, and I have quite a question. Today, I may quiet for here. Mm -hmm. Officially, kid, mm -hmm. why are quiet? Don't be quiet. Oh. Does the Passover have anything to do with the movement of the sun in the zodi zodical, zodiacal, and uh, zodical hey, signs? No, the, the the sun has not. The sun governs the day, the hours, you know, time. That's what the sun governs. The moon uh, governs the season. Okay, so it, it has nothing to do with the Passover. Okay, it, it basically, it's, it's the season that we're looking at. You know, uh, every feast of our father, you know, Sunini Nanini, has uh, a specific time. Like now is the feast of the Passover on its proper time, which is in spring. That's where when he flooded the world, he flooded the world during the spring season mm -hmm. on the second month, you see? And then it, it, it's flooded for 550 days, which was five months, you know, which is 30 days per month. See, that's why there's only 30 days in a month. 12, for me, as far as I'm concerned, 12, it, you know, 12 months, 360 days. But when you read the book of the Jubilee and the other book, it says 364, but I tell you the four days are not to be added to the calendar days. Okay, so it's 360 days mm -hmm. completely. You know what I'm saying? Oh. Okay, yeah. Benedita Adumakon. Yes, yeah, so mommy, I'm happy you remember me. Do you know what? Um, this uh, um, uh, platform, eh, we have a whole TV setup. We are not just social media thing. 
we are a whole TV setup. And thank God, Dr. Kelly has a whole system. Even if you, you leave this platform and you create a new uh, um, fake account and you start typing, your English and the way you type will betray you. So we are not just joking here. We know everybody from day one till here. We know everything and we have every database. Dr. Kelly is working. As we are working now, our our uh, auditing stage, you say, what they been, they been, oh, hey, yeah, whatever you can think of. We are not just social media. We are a whole TV station set up. A proper one. And yet studios now said be a bomb bomb. You are watching the biggest and the largest. Hi. Uh, let me ask your questions for you, my dear. So, Benedicta, trust me, I know everybody. The cockroaches, the lizards, I know everybody. Kwesi Digital, they say, we Africans, I think this question is for you. Mm. Uh, so I, mm -hmm. <clears throat> uh, I know you are also watching the, uh, but you have to focus here. This is a question, Kwesi Digital. They say, we African come from Mesopotamia, where the land isn't as rich as we have here as we have here so we are so was our migration here okay my main kind of you okay they say we mm. africans come from mesopotamia where the land isn't as rich as we have here so we was our migration here a divine intervention in order to discover our true self with the creation? Oh, Mesopotamia, we, we stand in Mesopotamia, my sister. Whatever he has, whatever that person has uh, read, that's, uh, you know, that's total lie by the Gentile. Mesopotamia is in West Africa. This is Mesopotamia area right here, okay? Uh, Chat, you know, is the area in um, uh, Algeria and so on. This is Mesopotamia. And the civilization of men, the book of Genesis chapter 11, Okay, when it talks about the, you know going from the east, go to concordance, go to the strong concordance, and and you know putting your strong there, and look in the word uh, uh, the word from from journey from, and then from journey from is going eastward. They they can't be going, they can't be coming from the east if they're going to the east. Okay, they even come from the west, the north, or the south, and they will come from West Africa because the life of uh, of the black and brown people started in Burkina Faso, Niger, Nigeria we call that now Cameroon. In this other part, that's where it started at. Uh, no, is in the Burkina Faso, Pele. All these are there. You can giggle these names. They all in the, they they all in the, in Google Map. It's in Google Map. Go Google these names. Sometimes they you know Pele they add maybe like a a n g to it, but that's Pele. So the civilization of the black and brown people start in West Africa. That is the reason when we the Bantu people were migrating, you know, exiting uh, uh, Cairo, Egypt, we came back to our father's land, the original of our father, before we start claiming this, the, the, our promised land from from Egypt, uh, across the Nile River. Uh, uh, Sudan bottom, then Tahat, Algeria, where Tahat is at, it's in the Bible, from Tahat to Terra, Niger, okay, this is our father's land, Niger, and then from there, Haran, then Padan Aram, Cameroon is Padan, Pad, pa, pa, uh, Cameroon is Padan, Aram is Nigeria, okay, then we start going up, up, up. To so everything has changed. Everything, yeah, the white man don't want, the Gentile don't want you to know the truth. Uh, Namibia is where Mount, the Mount Sinai, uh, Mount Horeb, it's all in Namibia. You can you can still type it. Go type in Brandenburg Mountain. You type in Brandenburg Mountain, you'll see it over there. It's the only mountain that has a big, big black spot in there. Mm -hmm. And it's the best granite in that mountain. The best, best granite in the world is in that mountain. Mm. Because that's our father's mountain. That's where he spoke to our people. Okay, so Kwesi Digital, you hear that? Snap cell, my name is Ramsey. I'm speaking from... I'm speaking from mommy. I want you to know that I love you so much. I honor you and I appreciate you. I'm really humbled, my dear. I love you back, okay? And I send you love. Richard Kofi Moonlight, beautiful sun goddess, Labraska. Please ask him that he said, please, this is for you. Yes, I'm listening. Nene is the father. And mm. Nene or Nini means king. In our language, which king is he talking about? And this name is he talking? And his name is he talking about Anu, Enki, 
Tot or Anunnaki? No, we're talking about Nini, okay? We're talking about Nini. Nini is the father. N-I-N-I, -N -I, Nini. It's the easy closest language from South Africa. Like I said, you can Google it, and then you can see they're still singing to our father's name, Nini. So, because that's where our father's name said his name will be recorded there forever. So his name is Nini. Now, being that we are the children of our, our father, Nini, then we could have named our kings like Nene or mm -hmm. Nini too also, you know, because we know it's our authority. It's our father. But Nini is the king of king. Nini hey, is the king of king. Dan Adu, you want to bring problem? Mm -hmm. hmm? Dan Adu, this is a question for you anyway. He, it's a, his question, so I need to ask. Mami Grace, please, I want to know, is tight paying a must? Uh, no, it's for it's for right now. No, it's just scam. Again, these speeches just scamming our people. Uh, now, if you want to give a free will offering to to someone, fine. If you want to give a, if you want to help someone, it's better off you helping that person because maybe that person will pray to our father. Hopefully, if he knows our father, and our father can give you that blessing, and our father will give you that blessing because as it says, Masindi says, if you help someone, you have helped me. You have helped the father. You see what I'm saying? Because the father wants us to help one another. Because Abraham, our father, was the type of man that he stood in the mid there waiting for people to come and bring strangers into his house. You see? That's our attitude. That's the same way we are. We don't mind feeding someone if the person's hungry. Well, I was born at, in Cape Verde. I'll tell you, my people, uh, though, but, but, uh, you, can't, you can't come out of Cape Verde's house and not eat now. As uh, soon as you sit down, somebody's cooking for you. They're going to bring you food. Like it or not, you're going to eat. You're not coming up until you eat. Yes, that's how we are. You don't go. You don't go to Cape Verde's house without eating. Mm -hmm. But you don't live without eating. You're gonna eat. You're gonna eat. <laughs> that's how it is, and that's our father's hospitality. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's the type of people we are. We are hospitality people. We the type of people that we want to feed the world. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? We want to share what we have. Am I correct? We want to share what we have. Mm -hmm. But the Gentiles, oh no, they want it all plus the kitchen sink and everything else they have. They don't. Even, they don't even want us <laughs> in the land. And then they want me to talk for other people. Oh, he ma kumse no say good evening, ma mi grace. Our world star number eight. Oh, good evening, oh he ma papa bi. Epel nyanseni pa. Good evening, my love. Florence, nice to go kwati. Hey, my Florence, anya is you? Anya is you kwa wo page we say is on some. We better say ma matcha say. We do not kwa na umu ni a onya umu. You are watching the biggest, in fact, mommy, please ask him, please, this is a question for you. Mm -hmm. This is Valan. I think I've asked this question already. He said you should kneel and open your arms. In, in and your hands, let spread your, your hand eye forward. Open let your eyes be open. While right. you, while you pray to your while father. While you pray to your yes. father. Don't close your eyes. Don't close your eyes. When you are not crown for no. When you are not crown for no. When what the idea called? Okay, so uh, this is a question for you, Charlie. Somewhere, hey, explain how to prepare the unleavened bread. That's oh, a great question. Oh, and all you need is water and flour. You know what I'm saying? They water, don't flour, put yeast in it. I no, no, that. no yeast, no yeast, because yeast is what makes a level and stuff. Mm -hmm. You know, that's why anything that you have at home at that time, you know, for the seven days, it's yeast. You put it away. You know, put it in a bucket. You know, bring the bucket outside or something and leave it there. Don't throw it away because you have to buy it again. You know, it's not right. Mm -hmm. Just set it outside, set it somewhere, mm -hmm. and then you come and use it. But when you prepare the bread, it's just water, uh, salt, and you know, because you should put salt in everything you cook. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can cook, cook food without salt, mm -hmm. and then a little bit of oil if you want, and that's basically. It. Okay. And then use a frying pan if you don't have a thing. You know, you just roll it up. Use a, a regular frying pan or mm. make that dough yes, for you. Yeast, you know, my name Yes, no yeast, no yeast at all, no yeast at all. Fried and it's good to be away from yeast for seven days. It's mm -hmm. good, healthy for the body. Okay, so yeah. Charlie, uh, he, um, you've gotten your answer. So you tell them what be we near to. Okay. Penelope, wow, one day I will share my experience and testimony on of revelation. Thank you, Queen Hadasha. Thank you so much. We are doing this to get that. Mama, please ask him for me who is the father. We are explaining she's he's explained this uh uh Kwame Charles, open to kwa. Open to kwa. Eh? Why do you write it for me to read? <laughs> eh? I won't read it. <laughs> Hit my G point. Hey, Mama, I greet you. I greet you. In fact, I love you so much. I love you guys. I would do anything for you guys. I love you, truthfully. I love you guys. And I send you love. 
wherever you are, a thousand folds, send you love, send you love, I send you love, I send you love, and I send you love, 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 love. Kobi Bonsu, also good evening, mother of all spiritual platform. I know the bam, Baku saying, Mommy, uh, this is, eh, let me see um, Facebook, so we read the comment too. You are watching the biggest and uh, largest. I think you have to advise them or about the living, uh, the Passover mm -hmm. and the living bread. Let them know the importance mm -hmm. of uh, if you can celebrate yes, it, yes, yes, how yes. they can, they, they should start, well, mm -hmm. how they can, you've explained a bit. Okay. But the Passover, the living bread, how mm -hmm. to take it and mm -hmm. all that, mm -hmm. because okay. they do it in Christendom as, as, yes. as a, a, a Lord's Supper. Yes, uh -huh. yes, so yes. So I want you to, yeah. uh, our time is almost, so I want mm -hmm. you to tell us how to, prepare it you've shown them how to take it how to go about it mm -hmm. and all that please kindly take us through okay the the the, the passover you know the passover is again like normal it's just uh, if you have a piece of lamb or, or goat and stuff you know that you can uh, cook on that day and stuff you know and you can go ahead and cook it at evening time and eat it uh, you cannot leave anything at the end of the day or at the end of the night to the the next morning so you got to eat everything at one time if, as, as a memorial mm -hmm. as a memorial to, you know for that day and then when it come for the passover at evening you know you're going to be making your bread it starts in the evening again then your passover bread should be made just like a regular bread, but just without unleavened bread on it and stuff. And, and you can eat that anytime you want, even when you're hungry. It doesn't have to have a specific time. As long as you're hungry, you're eating that bread because you, you're going to be eating other stuff anyway, other food. But it's just that you cannot have bread made out of leaven, you know, made out of yeast in it. Mm -hmm. no, meat with yeast in it, excuse me. So your bread always got to be unleavened, no yeast in it. So that's, and you can eat that bread at any time. You're hungry, eat it. So you should make a whole bunch of it. That's why I say use a frying pan after you make it. Use a frying pan to, to you know, to, to get it heat, heat up. And then uh, you can eat it anytime you want. That's how I do mine. You know what I'm saying? I use a frying pan and I put mine there and I eat it, you know. And then it's there. When I eat, when I need it, if I want, I can even turn the frying pan, put it there and warm it back up and then eat it again. You see what I'm saying? That's the best thing to do with that. And that's for seven days. I'll have to, you know, 21 days, 21 Mm -hmm. And then after that, it's a holy convocation unto our Father, giving thanks to our Father for these seven days and stuff, you know. And uh, that's basic. So everything, everything is is having a prayerful mind with your Father, because remember, this is all about your Father, recognizing your Father. So your mind and your thoughts always got to be about your Father. So try to sustain yourself from doing any argument with anybody, because why? It's a special day for your Father. So try not to argue with anybody. You know, try to speak only about the Father as much as you can. Okay, let your conversation be about the Father. Then your Father will bless you for it. You know what I'm saying? He will. He, he will bless you. Because uh, uh, me, uh, people always tell me, every time you speak, man, every the Father comes in. I say, that's what's in my mind is my Father. Because remember, sports and all these other events that these Gentiles has given us to keep us away from our Father. You mm. see? They don't want us to speak about our Father because they know if we speak about our Father, our Father listens to us. My people is crying. My people is talking about me. And he will come on our aids and stuff, you know. And, and I heard, some, I saw someone over there. I will answer that question. Someone talk about, uh, was the name Israel created to keep us away and from the, the yes. question, The co question just came here. Yes, yes. Uh -huh. uh, it, it, it's, it, it's, it's definitely what it was created for, to keep us away from who we are and to bring us into the religion. The religion that, was, that was, yeah. um, that was due, Kennedy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I yes. said, the sound goddess, please ask. Ask our great, our guests, if the country Jerusalem mm -hmm. and Israel was created to establish the religion agenda. Correctly. That's exactly what it was established for. Mm -hmm. It was established to keep us away from who we are, mm -hmm. you know, by stealing our inheritance and establish this Christianity and all this stuff. Because nothing happened outside Africa. Our people got to understand that. If this is the Holy Land, why would you want to keep thinking about that Levant area? There's nothing there for us. It's nothing but wickedness. Return to your father's land. You already here. Give thanks that you're still here, mm -hmm. that your father didn't take you out like he took my father. You see what I'm saying? And Praise your father and give thanks to him and our father will lift us back up mm. you know we're, we're, 
he don't need nobody's help. All he wants us to do is to return to him, and he will do all the work for us. And I thank our father, you know, very short, that he has allowed uh, uh, Gabon, uh, Mali, uh, Niger, Burkina Faso to get rid of these coconut leaders. Hey, coconut leaders? Uh, coconut leaders, and bring in someone there that's going to take care of our people. So I thank our father for that, and I hope he does it to all the French colony. Then after that, he does it to the Nigerian country, especially, let's start in Nigeria, because we know that guy's a coconut, as far as I'm concerned. Yeah, he's a coconut. I'll call you a coconut, okay? You know, uh, he needs to come out of there and let someone that's young, because he's old, let someone young that cares about our people and raise our people up. Because why should all the natural resources that belong to our people be given to the Gentile? We need to stop babysitting the Gentile. They are not our problem, people. They are not our problem. They are not. They, they are not our problem. Don't make them your problem. The problem is the coconut. Yes, the problem is our leaders. You know, and a lot of our preachers are the same way. They're just a bunch of coconuts because they don't want to tell our people the truth. And if they know the truth, they don't want to because what, what the lady said, they want to pay Thai. Or you pay your Thai. You pay Thai and then they want to go and have sex with your wife. You know, that's how they are. Instead of having sex with a whole bunch of young women, go and marry as much as, go have as many wives as you want. Our father don't stop you from having many wives if you want, as long as you can afford it. Go and have many wives. But you want to go and take another man's wife, commit adultery. You know, you think that's nice. No, that's, that's wicked. That's really wicked. Leave that man's wife alone. Look what happened to David, how he suffered for many years. Absalom come and taking over his kingdom, and then coming back and be the king again because of his wickedness. The only thing that saved David, our father, at the time is because David loved our father. His heart and his mind was towards our father. That's why our father didn't get rid of him, you know, because David loved Nini. He loved our father. He yeah. loved our father. Our time is almost okay. done. But I will ask this question, then we go. Mrs. Tutu, I'm seeing you. I'm seeing you. I'm seeing you. The last question. Please, what is the difference between the Lord's Supper and the Passover? Uh, the Lord's Supper. And the Passover. That's a, that's a made-up thing. That's a, that's a made-up thing. That's a made-up thing, Christian thing. It's a, it's a made-up. Forget about that. Because you're giving the body. You're, uh, what, what, are you a cannibal? Are you going to eat blood and drink, you know, drink? Are you drink flesh of human being, of men? Are you? That's a made-up thing. Get rid of that. Don't even think about that. That's garbage that they put in there to keep us away from our father. Uh, we cannot eat, symbolize, even symbolize to drink wine as blood or to drink bread as flesh of a, of a man. Uh, we are not cannibals now. We are not cannibals. We are righteous people. So that stuff, forget about that Lord's Supper stuff. Forget about it. It's nothing to be worrying about. The, the Passover is something that happened to our people. This is our father showing the difference between the Egypt and the Bantu. Okay? That's what it is. A difference between, and to make, to, to make sure that they let go the first son of our father, Nini. And he said, if you don't let go my son, my son, I could be the firstborn. I will kill your firstborn. And what did our father do? He killed everything that was first. Even the grave, even the dog, uh, uh, even the dog dig up the firstborn out of the grave and bring him out. Yes. The dog dig him out, bring him out. <laughs> and bring him to the house. Mm. Okay, see? Abusia. Um, Yanji, your last words, please, your last words, and then you give them your number in case people want to ask you questions and all that you can, uh, so they ask you, Abro, so Gaddafi, hey, mommy, Grace, you know me too. I know everybody, Abro, so Gaddafi, I know you, Papa. Thanks, thanks the cosmic mother that my Grace know me. I know you, Papa. I brought so good I brought. Me very few crime. Me kayo be nim crime. Me kayo. I brought so. I brought so. Hey. Um. Please, your last words. Uh, Dan Adu, you want to put me in trouble? Oh? <laughs> I um. I won't read. <laughs> Obi, I read it. Dan Adu, no comments. Now I try to see Adu. I won't. <laughs> I won't ask this question. I don't want trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Are you not listening I, back to me? I'll, I will answer. Just ask. I don't, I don't, I'll answer. I'm a very truthful <laughs> person. I'm going to tell you the truth. Dan Adu, Mami Grace. Uh -huh. mm. Please, if the Nigerian president is old and he is coconut, then what does he say of the current Ghana president? Hey! Oh, it's same thing. He's a coconut. Because he's still following the leaders. Of, he's still following the, 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 the thing of it. Look, look. Why are we borrowing money? 
The reason we borrow money is because IMF or BSI or SBI, the International Settlement yeah, Bank or Interna Bank of International Settlement, is forcing the, the, the country that I like to call the third world country, such as us, you know, and, uh, you know, they are forcing us to do these things. They are forcing us to be in debt with them. Because what is in the book of Deuteronomy? The book of Deuteronomy says, my people, if you do not obey my words, you will be a borrower, not a lender. Mm -hmm. So we are borrowing from these people. You know what I'm saying? Okay, Kwabena uh, Bafo, he said that. I say we make me a worry. You said you, you can men, marry many, but don't take somebody's don't wife. Don't take somebody's uh, wife. So well, if someone is asking about multiple women, it's nothing wrong with many women. They many said there's nothing wrong, but don't take somebody's own. No, no, so, don't do that. <laughs> Stop it. Official Elkin, I won't mind you. You people yeah. want to put me. Please, your last number and then you, your last words and then you add your numbers to uh -huh. it so that people can call you and ask you questions in uh -huh. case uh -huh, they want to get through to you. Please. Okay. My, no, all I can say to the audience is stuff. you know, I love my people. I love my people very much. My only hope and prayer is that we'll all return to our father so our father can do good for the land because it is our land. It is a holy land. It is a blessed land. Why should we suffer as a people, you know, in the hands of the wicked? We should rise up as a people and come together as the Bantu people and unite ourselves as one nation so that way we can prosper out of it, you know, and, and feed our children, you know what I'm saying? And uh, as for me, you, if you're interested in contacting me, you can contact me at 057-632-5704. That's my number. It's a WhatsApp number also. Say so again. 057 632 and our Father will bless us. I believe strongly if we walk together, if we be together, our Father will bless us. These Gentiles don't have nothing against us. We will, walk, we will stomp on them. We will use rock as a missile. When our Father throw those rocks, they will run away from our rocks. So we shouldn't be afraid of them. None of them. Actually, as far as I'm, kick them out of Africa as far as I'm concerned. I have nothing against them. I don't hate them. But let me, you are done, but let me ask this before you go. So the coconut thing, is it because of their age or what? No, what? it's because of their, their leaders who are selling our people. Ah, so That's what makes them a coconut. That is a facilitator. A facilitator. A if you are facilitating for the white man to bring in this digital currency and all this abomination that the white man, the Gentile, wants to bring upon the world because they want to control the world, like in the quote in the book of Isaiah chapter 14, having total control of everything, then you are a facilitator. You are a coconut. You need to stop it. We don't need digital currency in any African so country. So when we see anybody, we have the money. whether the person is MP or I who is facilitating it's for facilitating. the white, we should call them... He's a coconut. Coconut. He's a coconut. So who is a coconut? All the way. In your constituency, your parliament, <laughs> who is a coconut? <laughs> Write your comments and let me see who you think is a coconut. Sure. <laughs> me, hey, I don't want trouble, but I, I, the man who said we should mm. use funeral to promote um, tourism, Mm -hmm. Can he be coconut? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I'm just asking. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming, brother. That's his number. You can call him and ask him all your questions. And then if there's anything you want to, you want him to help you with. You, you, uh, yes, you I will help. help. Yes, yeah, spiritual help I will help. I think yes. he has much to say. Mm -hmm. So you, uh, you call to ask him questions. He's giving you the number. Thank you so much for your time. Pels, I love you and love, 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 love. In, even we send love to the haters. Everybody, we send love and we send peace. We send love and we send peace. We send peace. We send peace. Love, love and hate, hate. I'm always there. Queen Adasa Macrow.